Welcome back, welcome back to CPAPHelpDesk.com. This is a video review of a nasal pillow system called the Opus 360 made by Fisher and Paykel. This is a fabulous mask. Uh, I tell you, of as of today's date, uh, whatever it is, January 17th, uh, 2011, of all the nasal pillows that's out in the market, this one consistently provides the best results with the least amount of complaints from my patients. Um, once again, this is truly one of the best CPAP nasal pillow system around. This is designed for somebody who is a nose breather, not a mouth breather. If you open your mouth, you need to use a chin strap or then you would have to go full. And if you cannot use a chin strap, you would then have to use a full face mask, right? Okay, so now this is truly extremely lightweight, okay? Uh, because the footprint is so small, you know, you see, look how small it is here. It really doesn't bother too much uh, around your face as far as bruising goes, uh, as far as bruising is concerned. Um, if somebody who has a thick mustache, this is fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. Yes, you can read in bed. As you can see, you can wear your glasses. You can watch TV. And uh, the only problem is if you're suffering from allergies during allergy season or just a head cold temporarily, um, you cannot use this type of mask. You would need to use a full face mask. Okay. Now, dryness in the nasal passages is more common here but is an easy problem to fix. Basically, you just increase your heat level on your heated humidifier and you will get more moisture. All right. uh, the reason why dryness is a little bit more prevalent here is because you have the nasal pillows are into your nostril. By the way, it's not shoved deep into it. It's just sitting lightly at the, at the, uh, at the opening of your nostril. Right? But you have two jet streams of air just constantly going into your nostril. Uh, now, this nasal pillows is not really recommended for somebody whose CPAP pressure who is uh, who's ten and higher. Okay, it doesn't. It no, no doubt this nasal pillows is designed to handle high CPAP pressures. But if you have somebody who's ten and higher in as far as their CPAP or BiPAP pressures are concerned, it's going to be very uncomfortable. Uh, that that is just one of those things. Now. The headgear is very good. Now this thing here, I'm going to point this up here. This is how you, it comes in the box or when you see a picture of it. Everybody who looks at it when they see this here, they say, oh no, I don't want it. But listen, let me show you this. You just unclip the Velcro and now this falls loosely. Actually, as far as this going over your head, it is a fabulous idea. Uh, there are two reasons for it. One, it reduces drag, um, you know, because when this is fallen down uh, across your chest and you have the CPAP tubing going across the chest, when you roll around in bed, you'll end up pulling the mask and you'll get, uh, get a lot of leaks. Number two, it just feels a lot more lighter, okay? Now, as the, the bad thing about the sizing of this headgear is one size fits most. Um, now, the, this, this is what I have to say so far about the head here. Now, let's move to the exhalation port. When you exhale, let me just zoom in a little bit. Right here, you see these little dots? That's your exhalation port. Um, it's very quiet. It does a very good job not blowing air into your bed partner. Now, you will always find exceptions to the rule. There'll be somebody who will complain sooner or later that, yeah, you know what, my wife or my husband is getting slammed by the air coming out of this but generally I have not had any complaints uh, from this particular nasal pillow. It's called this the Opus 360. The cushion and I want to show this to you. Let me pull this off here. Okay. Is It comes in small, medium and large. Can you see it says M? Small, medium and large. Those are the three cushions that comes in the box. Do yourself a tremendous favor make sure when you get the get the uh, the nasal this particular nasal pillows the home medical equipment company gives you all three sizes you want all three sizes okay because you can play around with it 
you have it now. Now here's one really benefit here. Do you see, I mean, I, I know this is sort of in the way, but let me bring this closer. Can you see there's almost a 45 degree, degree angle where it's not touching this part of my finger, right? So what happens here is one of the biggest complaints of most nasal pillows is everyone complains that it hits right above the upper lip. This doesn't because of this angle on it. And now if you have a mustache, this nasal pillows is absolutely perfect. Okay? Absolutely perfect. All right. So you keep that in mind. Now once again, this nasal pillows is extremely easy to clean and if it ever pops out, you see how this moves? It is so light. If this, you know, because when you move around a bed, if the pillows come off your nostrils, easy in your sleep to put this back into position. Okay, once again, this is the Opus 300, 360 nasal pillows made by Fisher & Paykel. I wholeheartedly recommend this. This, believe it or not, is my first recommendation to nasal pillows as of this date. All right, take care.